So today's web dev tip is all about the address HTML element. Now, if you haven't heard of the address element before, it's the correct semantic tag to use if you're trying to put a geographical address on your web page. So a physical address for a business or a person, uh, this is the correct tag that will indicate to search engines and other robots that are crawling your site uh, that this content inside the tag is actually an address. And it's really simple. Uh, all you do is use the word address, obviously, and you can put some content inside of here. So for example, this is where you would put your address in here. So somewhere street, somewhere town, uh, some uh, state, USA. So a couple of things to note, it acts like a block level element, uh, but the content inside uh, doesn't split onto individual lines. So you would have to do something like put line breaks in here, uh, such as with the line break tag to split that address onto separate lines. But other than that, you can put any other content in there. Say if you want to make a link, uh, and it's quite common to put things like telephone numbers or email addresses in there as well, assuming you want to make those kind of things public. So if you have heard of the address element before, hopefully this tutorial has just been a little bit of a reminder that it exists, because when was the last time you actually used this? If you probably put an address on a page, you might more than likely would have used a div element or something similar. So just remember that it is there and it is the correct tag to use if you're putting a geographical address on your page. Uh, just before we finish, uh, it's worth saying that uh, the text that the address element contains is usually emphasized by most browsers by default. Uh, so if that's something that you don't want to do, uh, then you can simply target the address elements with CSS and you can do something like set the font style to normal, for example, if you don't like that italicized text. So that's it for the address element. Stay tuned for more web dev tips.